hey everyone and welcome here on the short episode so you know last time i said why in this case you're seeing extra diet i mean flyback diet so i have decided right now i'm going to describe with you about this section so i think little bit discussion with you before explaining this circuit look that as you can see this one electromagnetic relay actually really like as a switch definitely when really active by the power it's going to switch to another terminal like this so this one is general purpose electromagnetic relay you can use to uh, such as low power device control general appliance also you can use your own big infosec okay second one multi terminal control relay it has several terminal so this one you can use to such as high power device control industrial based basic application or you can use uh, machine control motor switching fields device relative instrument as well so this is internal mechanism of electromagnetic relay suppose electromagnetic relay active uh, by the power while this terminal and this terminal going to connect to each other electromagnetic relay as a resource and commercially several types available uh, such as single pole single throw single pole double throw double pole double throw etc okay come to the main point why flyback used to as a relay circuit as you can see this is basic electromagnetic circuit this one is relay look that when i am providing phase biasing of the transistor transistor able to active another component so here is a component electromagnetic relay and when relay active you know a relay behavior like as a switch also it's create such a stress by the magnetic field like as a voltage source but if i broke the base biasing of the transistor look that electromagnetic relay provide through the back direction more than 50 plus back efm i mean voltage as a 5 voltage relay ultimately it create a lot of noise so you know it's normal behavior as electromagnetic relay but in this case this back efm voltage might be destroy your circuit it would be broke your microcontroller transistor biasing input device that's why we should neutralize voltage and reduce noise so how is it possible so if you would like to protect your circuit and reduce noise from another device you should use flyback diode this terminal and this terminal as a reverse but here is a question how does work flyback diode in this case look that when i'm providing base biasing of the transistor then relay normally working as a switch and itself create a charge storage but current can flow through the diode because diode as a reverse connect to each other and you know current can flow through the diode as a reverse only forward bias if i broke the base biasing look that electromagnetic relay can provide a lot of back efm i mean voltage it less than 1 voltage and 1 volt in this case wouldn't problem so when electromagnetic relay has been create back efm at this moment this one was a positive and this one is a negative and current only able to flow through the diode as a forward bias that's why current has been neutralized by the diode finally there is no lot of voltage and noise you know diode is used to several purpose but most of the case it's used to reduce noise and neutralize voltage so i think you got it why in this case using flyback diode